waiting for my friend to come pick me up and today we are going to Squamish or Whistler I don't know which is further away I think Whistler is further away from Squamish um, I heard it's snowing there and they are going to get about 25 inches of snow I don't look forward to that <laughs> so we might not get up to Whistler however we are going to the Sea to Sky Highway I heard it's very beautiful view out there and we just want to see so yeah just thought to do this quick vlog again <laughs> i'll take a full picture so there we go Christ, to have it underground wow okay well there you go yeah this is what it is i guess yeah, <laughs> it that's is. where you were right there oh right? yeah that's where we almost yeah. missed the turn yeah, yeah. yeah. oh i almost did it oh, twice that's, that's not far away i almost bought these buildings down here okay but a lot of the waterfronts that this is all going to be developed is all native owned and so it's leased so you never own the property you own the building but not the property right so, uh, so that's, that's the difference here yeah. there's, a, there's a lot of leasehold city owns some of it but i feel like it's raining over there yeah because yeah, of the dark skies right what, yeah what jack it looks like look it's, it's, it's nice over here yeah mm. <laughs> and not over here but in reality, if you end up not want to go, we'll come down and then I'll tour you all through the West End and we'll go even out to UBC and the beautiful sidewalks out there, the skywalks along the beaches and the ocean. Yeah. And you'll see where I used to live. It's gorgeous. Ah. I put my toe in because I haven't been in the Pacific Ocean before. So. Oh, there you go. Yep, got to put my toe in to say that I was... Ooh. You scared me. Oh, I thought you can't go here. My bad. They did it one way. Right here. My bad. That's all good. As long as you didn't turn down it. <laughs> See, that's a one thing that's really changed when I moved back. All these streets are one way. They didn't hmm. have all the bike lanes in. <clears throat> I think it's great. I think it's uh, safety first. Like I mentioned earlier, today is a road trip to Whistler. We're going to pass through Squamish and we might stop by the ski resort in Squamish or just get to the ski resort in Whistler at once. We'll see. We're going through the Sea to Sky Highway and the drive is absolutely beautiful. I'm trying to show as much scenery as possible. Um, Squamish and Whistler is in the lower mainland north of Vancouver and it's a beautiful drive. The drive uh, through the Sea to Sky Highway goes through the mountains, the ocean to the left and you're going to see lots of islands as I go along this trip. If you're just watching my vlog for the first time, thank you for stopping by today. Please remember to hit the subscribe button. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you for stopping by again to watch this video. Please remember to subscribe if you're yet to do so. And give this video a thumbs up as well. Thank you for watching. It does that. These are beautiful. Oh, this oh, I missed that way. Now, yes. we are on the Sea to Sky Highway. Oh, but you got to know something. When we won the Olympic bid, this was a one way down and a one way back off of a cliff. This was all made. Oh, this is oh. new. Oh, okay. This was yeah, all, this like was all built because. So yeah. we're going up and down, up and down, and finally we're just going to be going up. Okay. Now we're going now back we're going up. Again. up. There you we are in Whistler. Did anybody want a hat? I, I want meat. 
Gloves. Look gloves here. You and little gloves. What about you? you? Thank you. I got them. Okay. Little gloves. Okay. Are those okay? Sure. Perfect. Okay. Oh, she's wearing her beanie hat. <laughs> um, now my hair find is. Find out how much parking is here first. Yes. Right here, right? Yeah. Okay. okay. Woo! You're fixing the car. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hilarious. Okay, guys. Okay, me too, yeah. No, Whew, just nice weather. Uh -huh. Fairmont. Yeah. We saw a Fairmont Hotel in Yo Yo Town. Yeah. Remember? Can we just cross here? Uh, can we? Yeah. Okay. We're in sneakers. Great people. Great people. <laughs> right. We did it. For some reason, when I take too big of a step, this shoe comes off the backside. Oh. <laughs> oh. Okay. Yeah. Hey, it's not raining right now. Mm-hmm. We got a little bit of We passed by Squamish, but we didn't come down from the car. We just passed by. It wasn't really interesting to come down. We didn't see any fun activity to to engage in. My friends really wanted to stop in Squamish, but I made the push so we'll get to Whistler. And I'm happy we did. I'm sure they're happy we did as well because they kept seeing it. Um, Whistler is very cold. They got ice. It snowed the previous day and it's really cold. So we all had to wear gloves, uh, beanie hats. And thank God we all came with um, an extra pair of jackets and that's it so this is a ski heaven like lots of people here skiing it's a ski village let's just put it at that it's a very nice place lots of skis there you can see the gondolas as well and everybody is just here literally to ski except you came for tourism like i did just to see the place and yeah i could see um vehicles from the u.s as well based on their plate numbers like they just come here to ski and have fun so if you love to ski and you're in canada you might want to check out whistler in british columbia i try to ask you why but you never say a thing once you hold me tight i feel i'm gonna play it and even though your eyes will not talk about me Feel like I have changed since you decide to leave But once you hold me tight, hold me tight again No, 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 no Cause I know when I close my eyes you're somewhere emotions that you never let me breathe how to find something else inside the world that please whenever it gets cold i know you're warm into his arms whenever it gets warm you know i'm thinking but when i was talking alone no one who hear a thing yes i was driving alone no one to understand me But once you hold me tight, hold me tight again No, no this is the Whistler Village Center and it has lots of different pubs, restaurants, stores that you could get things like say fridge magnet or if you want to buy uh other products as well so we stopped by here to get pizza there are lots of other things you could buy to eat i was hungry i was getting hungry so i had to get pizza i got pepperoni and it was really really nice honestly i got a slice just to carry me through because we came with snacks as well so there was something to eat when we get back to the car however there were lots and lots of people here you think it's the holiday season but amazing it's just the middle of the month and so many people just came here to ski it's a fun place to come with your family but then i warn you it's cold around this time it's getting better though the weather is warming up but it's currently cold so you'd want to dress the part
can see is where the ceremony happens where they launch the sport and lots i'm told that lots of people come here lots of crowd just to watch the sport there are lots of winter sports that takes place here during the olympics and then i took a couple of pictures as well and it was just great to see so whenever we win the bead um for the olympic sports it for for winter it always happens here and this is where most of the sports take place these are my friends just doing what they know to do best <laughs> please remember to hit that subscribe button here so watch it right oh yeah so <clears throat> this this whole area mm -hmm. has no vehicles nothing it's only um bus loads come out so oh. unless you pre-planned years ahead to rent something here you could get in here Wow. So that's why people were all here. It was completely like like ten thousand people here. And right over here is where they had the ceremony. So whenever they oh. got off the hill and whoever won, and there was remember everywhere, all over this the entire Winter Olympics, all came here and party. It was an open bar. Oh. And they had the ceremonies where they gave out the medals that was on TV. Oh, I see. So cool. I oh. never made it up here. I went to the Cypress. Okay so that's it guys we had to drive back and the part about this trip that i enjoyed the most is the drive the drive to and fro was absolutely beautiful and then there were lookout spots so um this lookout spots you can just stop like the name implies you stop to look out the view is amazing like this is one of the lookout spots pictures don't do enough justice to this like we saw a rainbow we saw the sunset i'm always curious as to where the rainbow starts and i could see the very start of the rainbow from the water and the mountains and then the roads are beautiful you're seeing the mountains to the right or to the left depending on which way you're at per time and then the ocean to the left when we're coming and it's just so 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 beautiful and while driving we crossed um, many different weather it's it rained it became cloudy it became sunny just overall beautiful and then we stopped by the beach to have a good view of vancouver city and you can see there to the right far away that is vancouver downtown just beautiful beautiful it was cold but we had to do what we had to do i hope you enjoyed this video today thank you so much for watching i would highly recommend a road trip to whistler like i did it's really beautiful and i heard it's even more beautiful in summer so you may want to plan that please remember to hit the subscribe button thank you so much for watching today watch out for the next vlog see you bye